This is for your level methods. It's question number three out of six point seven. Using first principles, find the gradient function of this. Okay. Using first principles, then the gradient function, that is the derivative of f of x, which is f dash of x, will equal the limit as h approaches zero of f of x plus h minus f of x over h, which in this case is going to equal, if I put x plus h into here, then f of x plus h is going to equal 3 times x plus h squared plus 6 times x plus h plus 1. That's going to be x squared times 3 is 3x squared. 2xh times 3 is plus 6xh. h squared times 3 is 3h squared plus 6x plus 6h plus 1. So it's going to be the limit as h approaches 0 of 3x squared plus 6xh plus 3h squared plus 6x plus 6h plus 1 minus 3x squared minus 6x minus 1 all over h. Okay. The 3x squared and the minus 3x squared adds to 0. 6x and the minus 6x adds to 0. The 1 and the minus 1 adds to 0. So I've got the limit as h approaches 0 of 6xh plus 3h squared plus 6h all over h. And that equals the limit as h approaches 0 of h outside of 6x plus 3h plus 6 all over h. The h's cancel. I can now limit h to 0 and that will go to 0 so it equals 6x plus 6. That's what the gradient function of f of x is using first principles. Okay, part B then says, hence find the gradient of the tangent at x equals negative 1 and x equals 0. So when the gradient at x equals negative 1, therefore I have the derivative the gradient function equals 6x plus 6. So the derivative when x equals negative 1, I can't draw this pen, is going to equal. So you put x equals negative 1, that's going to give me an answer of 0. And at 0, so f inverse when x equals 0, is going to equal 6 times 0 plus 6, 6. And part C, hence find the coordinates of the point on the curve at which the gradient of the tangent equals 2. So f dash of x equals 2 because the gradient equals 2. So 6x plus 6 equals 2. 6x equals negative 4 x equals minus 2 thirds. The question asks, where is it on the curve? So I know that it's at minus 2 thirds. And then I need to find what f of minus 2 thirds is. I go back to the original, which is this. And I put minus 2 thirds into there. 3 times minus 2 thirds squared plus 6 times minus 2 thirds plus 1. That's going to be positive 4 on 9s, 
threes will cancel that. So that's going to be 4 on 3. Um, minus 12 on 3. Plus 3 on 3. Which gives me an answer of minus 8, minus 5 on 3. So minus 5 on 3 is the y-coordinate. So that's where the gradient's going to be equal to 2.